Turns out that uh, it's always going to be weak acid, weak basis. So here's some uh, cartoon drawings for you. So you can imagine making your own buffers. Okay. So you can make a, we made an acid, we made a buffer with uh, HF and fluoride. You could, if you wanted to, make a buffer with acetic acid and sodium acetate. So acetic acid is the uh, weak acid. Sodium acetate, the acetate is its conjugate base, so that's the weak base. Or you could make a buffer with ammonia, that's a weak base, and it's conjugate acid, ammonium, NH4+. And of course you go grab some ammonium, it's an ionic compound, it's got to have an anion with it, so ammonium chloride. You don't have to use conjugates though, okay? You can mix and match any way, which way you want. You could make a buffer with acetic acid and ammonia. You could do it, I believe in you. Or you can make a buffer with sodium acetate and ammonium chloride. Or if you want to get really crazy, all right, like late night, Friday night, you want to make a buffer with just one compound, go with ammonium acetate. One stop shopping for buffer. You've got your ammonium and you've got your acetate, weak acid, weak base. Buffer. Okay, that's all you need weak acid, weak base. 